like to show you my first design team project for Factoria Designs and this is what I made of from this lovely kit and I put the links all below this video and every other video because I made a tutorial of this yes I am so you can make it if you like and thanks a lot for following my tutorials and adding me lovely comments so let's see what I have made first I want to say I did get my inspiration from another YouTube uh, channel and I put the link below from her great site great uh, YouTube channel and I did use the same measurements as her so if you like to use her tutorial so please check it out she is amazing and did a wonderful job for this so I did mine so um, let's get into it's a little uh, yeah it's it's a Paris team and it's lovely vintage and much pink so this is the front and I let me show you from close. I printed this out and I made it black. And I did use some nice flowers and some lace and some bronze embellishments. And I used cabochons. And I think it's lovely. And this one is a paperclip from Prima Marketing. And I believe I did use all the flowers from Prima. And for this one you can take the card out and the lace I did not glue all down so you can leave a ticket also behind I think it looks lovely and from the spine I only used a little key as embellishment and all the way around I used the same paper now when you open it up this is pretty plain because I use the magnets here so it stay put if it's standing in a shell closet or whatever you put it on and let's go first to the left let's put something away and this opens up and the first page has two pockets the large pocket I embellishment I did uh, use a little embellishment uh, using the cabochons sheet with some bronze and some uh, stickable cabochon. Again, I use a little um, a paper clip, and when you pull this out, you can put a nice tag under it. And here I just made a simple card and this card it has a pocket on the back and oh. and um, these two are really great I just bought two dies from Ali and they are really great they cut lovely and when you cut it out there you can uh, there are also fold lines in it I don't know if you can see yes so you can see so it's easy to fold down and then you have these two this is a little envelope so I leave the leftovers from the little tags so you can put everything little what you like and that's not easy to put it all back in as you can see at the same time and that's over here and this is a little coin bag and I put also use the cabochons for closure and I did not putting put anything in here just yet but if you have small items you can keep them in here I think that was lovely to put in this album now the second part lots of room to make photos and in the first page there is a large tag 
that will can open and I leave it plain for photos and I did embellish uh, I did use design paper for the back now flip it over and there's a little pocket with a little tag a larger tag and a little booklet this one uh, we have also a great pocket a large pocket <laughs> it's also a booklet for lots of photos and you can leave photos on the back and the front also if you like and this flips to the left and here I glue already down <laughs> almost down just a little tuck spot where you can leave a nice card in it or you can put a large photo and this one is the bottom and I just used um, a die from my local store uh, the action and I really love this one so it puts a little touch to the paper so that was the left side now go to the middle in the middle I all that's the uh, the inside from the uh, spine I use a little cabochon bronze cabochon with a little prima flower and I thought it would be nice so let's go inside now on this side we have our clear pockets and I really like how it turns out and you can pull some cards out so this one is getting out and let's see this one can uh, move away from the side and and this one on top also can be moved and put in back of course now I did use um, some little cabochons and some sequins I really like it it's a little shaker and on the back side you see the same thing I did use a stamp for this one also ordered by Ali, Ali Express and so you can see you can put a nice photo on the back if you like and uh, we have another page a clear pocket page and this one can be removed and this one also and this and this one so you have three, four um, things to pull out and I did, did use a little um, sequence for that too so and on the back of course I used the pretty uh, paper and I used my stamp again and this is the bottom and again I used these two cut apart I really like this and for the last page I managed let's see let's do it this way um, no that's not nice my table is not bright now let's do it this way I made two pockets and I use um, these nice breads I found yesterday also in my local store action and I really like it for this um, two thick nails and I leave just a simple card in it and you can leave your photos in here if you like and on this side it's the same but another card of course <laughs> my nails don't always work with me as I like but we have this great tool so I hope you enjoyed and let's get to the next project thank you Victoria Designs for this lovely opportunity and see you next time thanks for watching